Sri Lanka's former president Gotabaya Rajapaksha, who fled the country in July after tens of thousands of protesters stormed his home and office in a display of anger over the country's economic crisis, has returned to the country after seven weeks. Rajapaksha flew into Colombo as international airport around midnight on Friday from Bangkok via Singapore. On being welcomed by his party lawmakers, Rajapaksha left the airport in a motorcade heavily guarded by armed soldiers. Uh, to get more details, we have my colleague uh, Shrija joining us. Shrija, uh, seven weeks after he fled the country, he's come back. Uh, what's on the agenda? Well, the Sri Lanka's former uh, President Gotabaya Rajpaksa has returned home. This is from Thailand. And, uh, of course, not really much on the agenda at the moment because if you clearly remember, this was the demand of the public because they kept demanding Ranil Vikramasinghe, the president of Sri Lanka, that he needs to be tried for all the offences and that the former president can cannot be on the run. Now, he was on the run for nearly two months following a massive uprising against his government over the nation's worst ever economic crisis. And also, if you clearly remember, Mr. Rajpaksa, he left the country on the 13th of July, after months-long mass public demonstrations, demanding his public, demanding his immediate resignation on the 9th of July. Now, clearly, on the, especially on the 9th of July, we went on to see how the protests had gained momentum. You know, from across the length and breadth of Sri Lanka, they had uh, uh, converged right in the center of uh, Colombo and also stormed into the president's house in Colombo and several other political buildings in the capital itself. Now, as far as Mr. Rajpaksa is concerned, Gotabaya arrived uh, uh, yesterday, late last night, at the Bandar Naike International Airport. Now, amidst this was amidst tight security, he was given a convoy as well. Now, after being received at the airport uh, as by the several ministers, even uh, Rajpaksa left the airport in a heavily guarded motorcade. Now, clearly, this has also come down heavily, especially by criticized by the citizens. In fact, questioning Radil Vikramasinghe that if at all, uh, you know, security and also a motorcade should be provided to the ex-president who has returned to Sri Lanka uh, on a Sri a Singapore Airlines, where he fled the country after leaving the country in deep economic distress.